Hello happy people! Welcome back to my vlog! Hope everyone is safe and enjoying life! Me and Dodong Matt is going to Tuscany Estate to attend the 21st birthday of his daughter-in-law. We first stop at the mall to have breakfast where we had a really good food and coffee. Matt is now getting used to being televised while eating. Here's the room tour guys. Matt paid $185 odd for one night for this room. You get to see beautiful, beautiful view of nature from the inside. It also comes with a nice bathroom, which I didn't realize it was not on this video. Here comes the rainbow after the rain. But even if it was raining guys, I was mesmerized by the view. What a place! This is their vineyard guys, and the leaves just started to grow. They make good wines here, guys. Do they have flowers there when they... They have grapes and new uh, grapes. This is Amber, the birthday girl. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Slow down! Slow down! Slow down! Wait, wait, wait! I haven't had put that guy in. My smiley darling with his gift ready to hand to our birthday girl. The next morning before heading back to Sydney, we visited the ongoing house building of Matt's son and his partner. It's a new subdivision in the area. You can see the houses are looking good and new. That's not this one. Yeah. Oh, get out of town. You're kidding me. Their house is huge, guys. And I love the colors of the tiles. Especially the kitchen area. It's not even finished yet. And it's already looking amazing. They're a young couple, and they already have this huge house. The garden is so wide that they can build another house here. Yeah, 
Hi, kamusta? Congratulations to this young couple! On our way back to Sydney, and I'm still not tired of recording the surroundings. The Bacows are busy mowing the grass. Countryside is so peaceful and clean. One of the things I love here in Australia is how people practice road discipline. They have wide bike lanes on both sides of the road bikers can relax and stay safe. In everywhere you look you will see how they prioritize the safety issues of people and that's awesome. Lots of road safety signals and reminders. You don't see that much of reminder in a country where corruption is being practiced. Thank you guys for watching, leave a like and comment. I will see you all soon.